Hello, Palasty Posse. Welcome back to Palasty. Welcome back to this fine Nuzlocke we're calling the Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke. In this episode, we are going to do some exploration of some sort. We're going to try to do some see. We're going to see what we can do around Moss Deep City. And if we have the extra time, we'll head into the Moss Deep City gym. But it might be a shorter episode. Just give you a heads up. I'm not sure. As the time as we're starting this recording, I'm not sure where we're going to end up, but it might be a little bit shorter than 30 minutes. If you're hyped, hit the like button, subscribe if you please. I really could use some, some support on the subscription side of things. We're kind of getting stale on the subscriptions for a while. So if you're new, make sure to hit that subscribe button and hit that notification bell and ring it to stay notified for future uploads. Let's get a quick team recap. We're, we're sticking with the same team. We're not changing much right now. We got Pineapple, Ludicolo, Volt Absorb, Tim in Nature, Mystic Water Holding with Razor Leaf Strength, Water Spout, and Surf. And we got Silver the Lugia with Shed Skin, Relax, Nature, Bright Powder as its hold, held item. Aeroblast, Psybeam, Fire Punch, and Surf. Crimson the Scizor Hustling with its Impish Nature. And Scope Lens, it's got Slash, Wing Attack, Pursuit, and Swords Dance as its move set. Crimson is followed by Amato Roster the Nine Tails with Synchronized Naive Nature, Charcoal, and Ember, Frenzy Plank, Confuse Ray, and Fire Blast. Jawbreaker the Golem has um, uh, Amulet Coin with Shell Armor, Naughty Nature, and a Rock Throw Magnitude Strength and Vital Throw moveset. And lastly, the newest addition of the team, Molly at level 31. Molly the Whiskash has Rough Skin, Serious Nature, Experience Share for now, Bubble Beam, Magnitude Surf, and Amnesia. Magnitude will be replaced by Earthquake at level 36, but we will get to that when we get to that. Next to up order of business is we are going to head up to the Shoal Cave. And we're going to get some encounters in Route 125, Route 126. Uh, yeah, we're going to get all, we're going to get these encounters all over the place. So we're going to actually, because we're, we don't want to surf, right? Surfing encounters, the, the level difference is, is such a wide span. But if we use the good rod... We're gonna register the good rod because we don't need a bike for right now. But if we use the good rod, we can basically guarantee ourselves some better levels. So we're gonna do that. A lot of our encounters are gonna be fishing encounters here in the future, and this is why. Better levels that are closer to where we're at. Woo! Okay. 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 Molly. <laughs> Oh, God, I know we just added you, but, man, what do I do? Because the dupes and species clause is an option that's not required. I'm going for it. I am just going to catch this thing, because we're probably not going to see... What did it have? It's got rough skin, too! Just like Molly! Uh-oh. Well... Ah, uh, this is actually gonna be really good for us. This is actually gonna be really good for us. Oh, you know what? It's biting. I have to not- I cannot attack it anymore. The net ball or the dive ball? Hmm. Dive ball would be cool if we could catch it in that. Nope. Alright. Uh, let's heal up. This is actually gonna be a tough- uh, tough catch, I can tell. I can actually already tell. Let's try the netball. One, two, three. Yes, sir. All right. So this is our Route 125 encounter. Now, it's four levels lower than Molly. And it's got the same ability. It's got the same typing. And it's it's a swamper. It's got better stats. Uh, wow. We might have to do this. We might have to actually... Wow. Well, never ever count out anything because Cobalt is back on. Cobalt is back. All right. Let's, uh, let's calm down for a second. Let's head into Shoal Cave. Let's get our Shoal Cave encounter, which we don't. I, if I don't. I, if I. Don't have to get it on the water. I'd rather not. Let's get a land encounter for Shoal Cave, a Nidorino. Great, great, wonderful. Let's just knock this thing down a little bit. 
Now we can try to catch it in Ultra Ball. I bought a lot of Ultra Balls. I shouldn't need any more Ultra Balls. I shouldn't need to buy any more balls for the rest of this playthrough. Need Orino. Hmm. And yeah, this is a tough one. What do we know that's a big... I don't know. I have... I've never had a Needle King. Um... I don't know what to nickname a Needle King. Wow. This is actually tough. I will have to look up a nickname. I will be right back. One look and I knew what I wanted to name this thing. What? One look and I knew what I wanted to name this thing. Biohazard. I just, I saw the one, I looked it up. I just looked up names for, for Needle Kings and let's, let's just spell this correctly, please. Uh, one look, and I was like, man, that's a sick nickname. I love it. Biohazard. It'll be transferred to the PC boxes. And that's going to be it for this uh, place. I don't... Maybe we should explore this place. Let me grab a... Uh, yeah, let's explore this place. Because there's some items in here that we might want to get. Uh, let's... Uh, I grabbed some more repels, by the way, too. I sold my, my weak, shitty repels. And I actually bought some max repels that we can use. So that we're not using repels so much often that we're able to get through this place. So let's see what type of, uh, what types of items we can find in here. Because each pile of salt... Or shell, whatever, that we find in here is going to be a different item. It's not actually going to be a shoal shell, so... Well, they are still shoal shells! Oh. Alright then. But there are still items in here, too. There still are items in here. Well, I'm surprised they didn't randomize those. It's weird that those didn't get randomized into, uh, you know, other items. They must be stuck that way. It's very, very strange. Oh! Another lucky egg! Oh my god! I, I can't get excited anymore. I've got two already. Add it to the collection. Throw it in the pile. I'm an egg magnet, boys. I'm an egg magnet now. I am an absolute egg magnet. Okay. Another lucky egg. <laughs> At this point, it's just silly. At this point, it's just silly. What is going on? Oh my gosh. Alright, we need one more shoal shell. It's not like I care about them that much, but here it is. And obviously, in a couple of hours, or whatever the time limit is, I think it's every two hours, this, uh, this cave's water level rises and lowers, so... The only way to get to the other levels of this cave is to wait till the water level goes down and it becomes way more uh, adventurous at that point for, for right now there's really nothing we can do in here it's very limited when the water is where it is so that's fine let's just get out of here and uh, there's some trainers we can take on if we want to but I actually don't want to take on any trainers right now our levels are kind of our levels are kind of fine I think for a little bit I'm not actually here to train um, I might grind off screen, like I said, before the gym, um, and, and use these trainers for grinding in a little bit, but for right now, I'm just trying to get some encounters. That was Route 125 in Shoal Cave. This is the Moss Deep City encounter. Yes, this is Moss Deep City. Alright, uh, do I have a Diglet? No, I don't have a Diglet. No Diglets! Mole Pokemon. Uh, Doug Trio, we are, is it a male? Yes, all right. Well, that's, that'll work. Uh, we're going to call this little guy the Reset. Should we just call him Resetti? Resetti. We'll just call him Resetti. Box one is full. Transfer to box two. All right, so Resetti will go to box two. That is our Moss Deep City encounter. This is a Route 127 encounter, which I said we were gonna fish for. And it said it's a War Turtle. The Water Starters are out. The Water Starters are out, and they are alive. 
This is a great episode of Encounters. Wow. Uh, do I want to hit you as a serve? Yeah. That was good. That was good. Ultra Balls. Ultra Balls. Oh my god, this thing doesn't want to catch. This thing does not want to catch. There you go. War Turtle, get in your ball. Its large tail is covered with a thick, rich fur. Uh, okay. Blastoise. I had a nickname for you, and I, I'm trying to think. What? Uh, ah! Yes, I remember now. It is... Shell Shock. We just got the shell, the shoal shell. But now we've got Shell Shock. And in other games, when we add, add uh, characters to the Pokemon, it would be Shell Shocker. But this is Shell Shock. So Shell Shock will go to the box. We've got another encounter there. Uh, where else? Let me throw some repels up and see where else we can get some encounters. Because uh, I know there's... I mean, we can basically go anywhere at this point. There's no limit. Um... To where we can go right now, except diving. We just can't dive. But we can just keep going down. The next route is Route 128. So we can get, we can get the counter. Yeah. Right? Pokemon app. Pokemon map. Route 128, Route 127. Okay, so that was Route 124, Route 125. We can get. Uh, so Route 128 goes all the way to Evergrande. Route 126 is around. Okay. So this is Route 128. Um, I think we're just going to get all these encounters now. I think we're just going to get all these encounters now. Let's, uh, let's fish. Um, that way, later on, we don't have to worry about the encounters. And we can just, we have them, and we're, they're in our box. And if we lose anybody, we've got a whole fleet of Pokemon to pick from. Oh my god, the power the encounters! The power encounters! Oh my god! These encounters! Oh my word! These encounters are off the chain. Um. I have to get pineapple out of here. And I have to start hitting this thing. But not with something too hard. I don't want to paralyze. I don't want to. Uh, I don't want to burn it. I also don't want to kill it. Okay. I'm gonna leave it right there, and I'm gonna start throwing balls. I'm gonna start throwing balls. I want the elements. I want the elements on the team right now. Stay in the ball. Ultra ball. Come on now. Oh my god. Shake twice, and I can do it. Game Boy Luke! That was the third shake, so it didn't really count. But, I am excited. We got that thing! Oh my goodness! Okay. It's a female Salamence. What are we gonna do with this thing? Oh my god, this is this name's gotta be fire. This nickname has to be fire. Alright, we're gonna name her Stormfly after the uh, dragon from How to Train Your Dragons. The uh, I think her name was Astrid's Dragon was Stormfly, so we're gonna name it Salamence Stormfly. And we're gonna have to we're gonna make some team changes, I think. Before the next episode, I think there might be a couple team adjustments because our encounters are way too powerful right now. Route 129, what do you have for me? Keep the power coming. I swear. You just keep it coming. Keep it coming. What is next? <laughs> oh, 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 it's dupes anyway. Uh, species clause. Species clause anyway. Oh, that was funny. That was real funny. Oh, man. Have a Butterfree already, so that's species as well, or dupes. Oh, I didn't mean to run into you. I did not mean to run into you. I actually bumped the, uh, 
speed up button by accident again. I hate when I do that. Um, so we're just going to have to hopefully take these things out with no problem. Alright. Now, I don't want any more counters right now. Repel. Route 129. Give me what I came here for. God, Route 129 sucks. <laughs> Route 129 is terrible. Oh my gosh. Five star ladybug. Ah. Uh, well. Well, you're a ladybug. And you're a female. Lady it is. Lady it is. Box two is where everybody's going right now. So let's just keep the encounters coming. Actually, you know what? I'm not going to get any more encounters for right now. Uh, throw some repels. I don't want to go any further to the... Uh, I don't want to go any further to the west because that will run into Pacific Log Town and other... I want to save those routes for the for a little while in the future. And, oh, not again. Well, we're about to have a team rebuild. In some in some sense. I'm not going to repeat. I'm not going to replace everybody. But, I do have to be careful on who I use here. I do have to be careful on who I use. Um, I have to be careful. I mean, I don't want anybody to die. But I mean, if somebody were to die... I mean, I was already going to replace Molly already, right? So we might just have to spam and hopefully, hopefully I get through this. That's a crit. I'm faster. I should be able to get through this. Because you safeguard. Molly? You're living, aren't you? Yes. Alright. Like I said, I wasn't gonna... I'm already gonna take Molly off the team. So if I was going to lose somebody, that's probably the best Pokemon to have basically tossed out. But luckily, where she's still there, and she's there for the future, if we ever need her in the future. Oh, God. I wanted this thing on my team. I wanted a Blossom. But I never got it. I never got it, and it's... That's... At least I have a, a Legendary out of my own. Arrow blast this Rayquaza. I don't have any other hit, no, any other way to hit this thing for for extreme damage. I'm scared it has something to hit me with though. Side beam it, take this thing out. Oh no! My defenses were up for the challenge. My defenses are up for the challenge. Rayquaza's gone. Get that thing off my screen. Molly's up to level 32. I. I really don't know what I'm going to do. I mean, team-wise, this is going to be tough. I've got a lot of tough choices coming up. Route 126, we do not have encounter yet, though. Uh, should I fish it? Let's fish it. And this will be the last encounter for the video. And I think after this, we can probably end it off. Do I have a... Do I have an Earth Ring already? I thought I did, but I clearly don't because it's so that I didn't catch one. So, okay. Maybe I'm thinking of Platinum. Maybe I'm thinking of Platinum. Oh, you know what? I don't know what I'm thinking of. I <laughs> I, I, don't know what I'm thinking of. But I will take it. Uh, Amaterasu? Oh, God. That did a lot of damage. Wow, that did a lot. Ember. Okay. 
And now we're gonna switch out again. Uh, Jawbreaker. To take the physical attacks as we throw our Ultra Balls. It's a, a male bear. That's even better. Yeah, I, I have the I have the name for this. I, I I don't know it off the top of my head, but I know I know the reference I want to name this thing after. It's Mordu. Mord Mordu. No, that's a comma. I want to go apostrophe. Mordu. From Brave. There's a D right there. Mordu. So Mordu will be transferred to somebody's PC. And I think that's going to wrap it up for the encounters for today's episode. We've gotten... Take a look at our Pokenav right now. This was an encounter-filled episode. We've got Route 125. We've got Route 1... We've got Shoal Cave, right? We got Route 124 last episode. We got Moss Deep City. We've got Route 127. We've got Route 126. We got Route 128. We got Route 129. So all these are water encounters have now been... They're, they're all wiped out, right? We just got them all. We got all, and then Route 130 and Route 131, 132, 133, 134. We got the, in, we've got all those to go. So there's a lot of encounters left. I just wanted to get these encounters uh, out of the way. This big chunk taken care of, and I don't want, do not want to battle anybody right now. Uh, where am I going? I'm trying to get back to Moss Deep City, but I don't know. I don't know how to get back there. I don't have anybody to learn fly or to use fly right now, so I have to kind of wiggle my way out of here. All right. So now we have some team decisions to make, and we have just a couple of minutes left for these decisions to be made. Um, and to be honest with you, I don't know how I'm going to make these decisions, but I know I do want to mix things up a bit. Alright, let's take a look at the natures of these Pokemon, because that will also help me. Sassy nature. It's a move set's trash. That might cause some problems. But for right now, um, I can teach it surf. Um, for right now, let's just do this. Let's just make a separate section here. Uh, Stormfly. How do you how do you how do you look at what do you got? Minus. It's got the ability of minus, so its ability is basically not very good. Quirky nature. It's got headbutt, leer, headbutt, or bite, headbutt, leer, and focus energy. So nothing really that great. Um I don't know if I can do anything with this for right now, but let's just see. You know what? Instead of instead of putting that on the team, let me just move Cobalt down here. These are possibilities, right? More do. I want to use you too. That rhymed and uh, it was unnecessarily. Oh wow! Lonely nature, insomnia. Oh man! If, it, if only its move set was better. <laughs> if only its move set was better. Uh, that's a lot of power. Shell shock. How are you looking? How are you looking? There's that cacophony ability again. Relax nature. High defense. Withdraw, water gun, bite. So again, the 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 move sets are trash. Chlorophyll, Resetti, modest nature's terrible, but raises speed, which is already fast. Wow. Magnitude dig, mud slap, sand tomb. So there's that. We never actually got a chance to look at uh, Majora here. Inner focus, rash nature with confusion, rock throw, hypnosis, side wave. Then we've got Dwayne. we got to pick which one to use. Levitate, brave nature. Karate chop, seismic toss. So, yep. Uh, we already know this. We're going to release Majora because I'm picking Dwayne out of those two encounters. So, Dwayne will be the Pokemon of the uh, Aqua Hideout that we keep. Paris, I never even nicknamed because Magma Armor. What a weird, what a weird ability for this thing to have. Uh, not gonna ever use you. And biohazard, water absorb, calm nature, double kick salt. Again, not, not great. But you know, those are the Pokemon that we have to think about. And I will do some thought, thought, thought provoking conversation. Whatever. I will do some thinking off screen, and I will figure out what to do. 
move sets and stuff like that i'll think about i'll i'll do some exploring and i'll let you know you go see in the next episode if we make any team changes or not uh, but i don't want to do anything too prematurely they're low level uh i have to do some grinding and i don't want to do too, anything too crazy again like i said their move sets aren't there moves aren't there it what we have is strong right now and i don't want to screw it up to go with some Pokemon whose move sets are not fully, uh, fully put together right now. We have a gym battle coming up too, so maybe we hold off till after the gym battle. And between this gym battle and the next one, we got some time to get these Pokemon to where the levels they need to be. But I'll look up move sets, uh, level up, you know, uh, learn sets and stuff like that in the off off screen, and try to make some good decisions. So thanks, guys, so much for watching. I appreciate your support. From here on out. It's going to be a strong showing. We've got a bunch of team members that are waiting in the wings that we can use if we want them. It's going to be fun. Hope you're along for the ride. Hit that like button. Subscribe if you're new. It's going to be an exciting end of this Nuzlocke. We've got two badges left to go with some story stuff. So you know what? But we've got quite a bit to go still. And then hit that like button. Oh, I already said that. Uh, ring that notification bell. That's what I meant. Ring that notification bell. And then I will catch you next time. Can't wait to see you then. New team? Maybe? I don't know. I'm, I'm rambling on. At this point, I just gotta shut up. Have a good one, and I'll catch you next time right here on Paulosity!